today i would like to discuss anthelm anthelm requires i mean quickness and uh, lot of work care if we try to make an effort uh, so far as i mean that of the work care is concerned we can definitely uh, follow our goal in this context i would like to also communicate to you i mean that of student that part of speech also plays a significant role we must know uh, whether the capitalized word is noun verb adjective or whatever it is sometime as i have earlier pointed out that sometime the verb in derivative the meaning is noun but if you try to solve our problem with the help of noun we can't do it so it must be our first and foremost duty that we should try to understand whether this word has been used as a verb noun adjective or whatever it is and second thing that is your exercise of work care and the thing which i am trying to communicate over here these are very essential according to the examination view point and according to the uh, other test and things like that now let us start i mean that of the first one the first one this one reprove reprove okay and we have five option what are the five option i would like to read it option a invalid date option b dissuade option c agree option d compliment and option d encourage so if we try to analyze some of that of the five options which is the most opposite you know reprove is a verb okay reprove is a verb which is a negative verb it means rebuke or to blame or to find fault and things like that before i find out the options that we must have all analyze i mean that of this word as i have told you reprove is a verb okay reproving for instance if i say reproving is an adjective and reprove is a noun so let us analyze i mean that once again i mean that of the solution of the problem reprove it's a verb means scold okay rebuke or to blame in other word it's a negative word okay we should try to find out most of it and definitely we need i mean that of the positive word 
So we have five options in front of us. First, A, invalidate. Invalidate. Any time to communicate, I mean, that was a negative, with not. You get? Invalidate. No longer in, in value. No longer valid. Okay? So, the first one we, we are trying to discuss. And B, second one. Dissuade. Again, it's a negative word. If we try to analyze, I mean, that of a whether it's a negative or positive, we'll definitely try to find out uh, our answer. This word means to refrain. Okay? This is also not our answer because uh, negative. C. Agree. To some extent, it's, uh, I mean, that of a positive word, but this is not our answer. Our capitalized word, meaning of our capitalized word is reprove. The next one, D, compliment. Compliment, it means formal greeting. Now the last one is E, encourage. So this is our answer. Encourage is a positive word and reprove is a negative word. Reprove means to scold, berate, blame, or whatever it is. And its opposite term, I mean, that of the meaning of a word is encourage. So, E is our answer. E is our answer. E should be our answer. Now, let us move towards, I mean, that of the next one. Number two. The tronic. Vitalik is an adjective. Vitalik is an adjective which means bitter. Okay? Or in other words, we can say bitter criticism. And we have five options in front of us. Option A, humble. This is not our answer because the tonic is an adverse word or negative word. And uh, second one, B. B. Pleasant. This one, B. Pleasant. And C. Retiring. And D. Thoughtful. And E, pure. So we have discussed I mean, that of the five options. Now let us move towards I mean, that of the capitalized word. The tonic, this is adjective, and it means bitter or bitter criticism. So which should be the opposite term, I mean, that of this word? That is, be the answer, pleasant. This one. The tonic means negative, bitter. And pleasant is quite opposite. I mean, that of this answer. So we move towards the next question. And what is the next question? The next question is ingratiate. Ingratiate. This one. And we have five options. Option 1, A, remove, this one, option B, mesmerize, option C, obstruct, option D, this one, command, option E, thank. Now let us analyze, let us read to, towards our answer. Ingratiate, I N G R A T I A T, ingratiate. Ingratiate is a positive word which means 
got into favor got into favor okay so we have five option remove miss prize obstruct command and tag now let us analyze i mean other the five options ingratiate capitalize word and we have five option option a remove option b mesmerize option c obstruct option d command option e thank now out of five option our answer is a remove ingratiate mean to get in favor to get in favor okay its opposite is word is remove the next one is b mesmerize is also a verb which mean hypnotize or fascinate the next one is c obstruct prevent progress obstruct prevent progress and command is very easy word okay now we move to towards e then so our answer is a remove now let us analyze i mean that of the next word or um, let us analyze the next question the next question the capitalized word i would like to speak i would like to utter accession accession this one accession and we have five option aloofness user patient retirement donation return so we have five options in front of us now let us analyze let us find out our answer accession accession in taking responsibility again on of the opinion this is a faulty word okay option a loosness loneliness user patient assume power or the next one is retirement i mean accession mean taking responsibility retirement mean uh leaving the responsibility so our answer is c the next one is donation and the next one e return now our answer is c now let us move towards i mean that is the next one veneration again it's positive word it's a noun okay we have five option we have five option okay and out of five option let us analyze on it out of it the five option veneration is a noun and a positive word so we should try to find out out of five option the negative one okay now let us analyze on it out of the veneration the first word is a ignorance b unconcern c detruation detruation a uh, detruation mean to refrain thing like that the next one is d this one contempt contempt me hater veneration mean to respect so both are opposite veneration mean to give respect contempt mean to give insult or in other word we can say hater does thing like that so it is a negative number e passivity passivity mean inert or passive or thing like that 
Now let us move towards I mean, the next one. Locatius. Locatius. Mean talkative. Location mean talkative. Okay. Now we have five options. Option A, adjective. Okay. Tessert term. Tessert term. Okay. Number B, abrasive noun. Number C, trouble. Very easy. Number D, irrational. Number E, inarticulate. So we have five options. So loquacious mean talking excessively or chatterbox or talkative. Its answer is tester, tester, A, A is our answer. It means one who certain type to talk or mute we can say. To some extent we can say mute. So what is the opposite of some that location? That is tester. Or the next one is uh, abrasive. Smoothing or polishing or thing like that or rubbing. So we have done I mean that of the sixth one. Now the next one is number seven. The capitalized word cursory. Cursory is also objective, and we have five options. Option A essential, option B polite, option C charm. Option D, comprehensive. Option E, inarticulate. Inarticulate. So we have discussed, I mean, that of the five options. Cursory, brief examination. Or in other words, brief. We have five options now. Essential, number one. Number B, polite. Number C, uh, charm. Number D, comprehensive. To communicate in, in detail. Or cursory mean brief. So this is our answer. It should be our answer. Now the next one is, the word is verdant. V-E-R-D-N-T, verdant. Verdant means lush green, overgreen, or green. So we have five options. Option A, complete. Option B, van. Option D, exposed. Option E, desolate. Now, let us analyze on the of it, these options. Verdant means lush green. Its answer is desolate, bare of any living thing or without any living thing. So, verdant is time to communicate on that of something greenery. When there is a greenery, we can, we, we are very comfortable in Amidara world, world atmosphere. But when we try to communicate Amidara of a desolate, mean a place where nobody is trying to live over there or barren land or things like that. So, our we have discussed some in that of the five option. Complete, when, forbidden, exposed or desolate. 
So we have discussed only that of the five option. Or the word vain means it's also an adjective, which means pain. But this is not our answer. Our answer is I mean that of a this one. You know, Verdon tried to give us an, I mean that of an idea where life is comfortable. One can exist over there. And this is a I mean that of an atmosphere where one cannot try to think I mean live over there or things like that. Yes, sir.